Hey everybody, this is Nigon from the IRA Forums. Just want to do a quick video uh, showing the new Parks Sabres that I got. So this is the OBEP1. I have the uh, Larble here. This is the, e, the EL Ready model that's on top. And then this is the new Parks one. I have to say I'm really shocked with the quality of the parts. I was not expecting it to be this good. Um, actually, some of you may know I actually did a deal since I already have this Larbrill. I didn't really need this OB, uh, so I, I sold it to somebody, and now I wish I could just refund their money. Haha. Ha. No, this is a really great. So let me go over the differences because they're honestly both really good hilts. They have some differences. I don't have like an MR here to show that to show you what's more accurate. I'm just going to kind of go by like what I like and what I think looks good, etc. Okay, so let's start with the uh, emitters. Uh, here, I think the uh, parks, which is down here, did a really good job. It's, you see it uh, starting with this ring. Uh, you know, the front of it has got more depth and shape to it. And also this ring, I don't think this camera does a good job of zooming in. One flaw of the new camera. But the uh, you can see the ring, like where it steps down and goes out, is like kind of the right length in my opinion to my eye that looks really right. On the larbrill here you can see it steps down and sticks out a lot. Now that's a minor deal because I'm just going to get that machine down to the exact size of this but that's one thing to note. Uh, next is the grooves because the larbrill is the uh, this is the E already model it's not as deep in the grooves here uh, the depth is not as accurate and that's so they can ha they can actually have a full one inch blade here. Uh, that doesn't bother me too much. I don't care about that. Uh, here, again, this has the more deep grooves. Uh, then here's where you go to where the larbrill, though, is highly superior, which is are these uh, these crowns and the, sh the shape, I think, of this. You see these slants and this crown. It just looks way better on the larbrill. This has got an a indent into it, which is definitely accurate from pictures I've seen. This parks here, it's flat on top. It just kind of comes up. It looks really cheap. That's the one thing I don't like about the parks. Um, and also, you can see on the parks, the. Let me zoom back out a little. You can see here the larval up top. It has this between here and here is shorter on larval, it's longer on the parks. Uh, not too noticeable, but. Uh, I kind of like having more black, like the larbrill. I'm not, I, I, like I said, I don't have, I don't have the measurements or a MR or something to go by to tell you which is more accurate. You can kind of choose. And also, the other thing I don't like as well in the parks is the shape of this. They've got this; it's kind of rounded, and I don't know if that's more accurate or not. But I like this larbrill one is more. It's kind of more triangular. I just think that looks better. Um, but the one thing I do like better about the parks is it may be hard to see without it going like this, but the uh, the height, the overall height of the emitter is closer to this ring thing, and it makes the emitter not look quite as chunky. I like that better. The larval, you can see this is really thick right here, and so like when you're holding the saber, the emitter seems a bit bigger um, than the rest of the body, which kind of makes it look a little chunkier in my opinion. <clears throat> um, and the last thing about the emitter is the Parks has the really big O-ring and the Larbro has like the smaller soft O-ring and I like that soft small O-ring much better. I don't like this big giant O-ring on this as well. Okay, so then let's go into the body. Um, the first big difference is the Larbro has the double step down and this is machined as one part. Um, this is way better. So the Parks, it's, it's, it's got a crown and it just goes straight down and it's actually there's a gap there because they actually this is a separate piece on the parks now it's not really that noticeable or a big deal but I do like the larval bit better here uh, then the in the grip section they're really both similar the main difference is the larval doesn't have quite as deep grooves because they it's the EL ready model so they you know it's got the it's got more space for electronics, that's the good news. The bad news is it's not quite as accurate in the depth. This parts, you can see, it's really got nice deep grooves. They're really nice. Um, but I actually prefer the Larbrill because of... I like the... Uh, it's a little thicker from here to here. And here in the parks, it's not as thick, and it, it looks too skinny. But I, th 
honestly, this might be more accurate. I just, personally, I don't like it so dang skinny. I like, I like some black there. I don't want, like, a puny little black. Uh, then the, the parks. This section is slightly longer than the larbral. Uh, they're both fine. I have no complaints on either one. I like them both the same. I don't know which is more accurate. But you can see this length is slightly longer than this. And then finally, the, um, the pommel. Now here, uh, besides the fact that, you know, this, this pommel is basically like constructed like the MHS pommel. And it's got the, uh, you know, you can see this, the metal all the way down into there. Whereas the larval is like all one piece. So just the cubes are painted, so the rest of this depth is all black. I like that. But honestly, all in all, this pommel of the parks is way better. It's got a better slant here. It's not quite as rounded, and it's the right size. This larval one is known for being slightly too bulky. It's a little tough to tell, but you can see this is a little more rounded here, and a little bulky, bulkier overall than this parks. Uh, so overall, uh, this parks is... I almost would say I, I slightly favor it as sad as that is because this I'm actually keeping the larbral and getting rid of the parks. Um, but it's a great saver, this new version of this parks. I was I was shocked. I didn't know that they had changed it when I made that order of those two. And so somebody was like, Oh, do you, do you want to sell the Obi? And I was like, Yeah, I don't want to just pay $400 and have duplicate hills. Might as well get rid of that. But yeah, it's a great saver. So anyone that did get on that run, I think you've got a really awesome thing there. Um, and. Uh, Anyone who didn't, yeah, definitely can, you can consider that in the future. It's a great deal. Um, the only other, I think, difference is just keep in mind this one is going to be, the parks is going to be a bit harder to get electronics into. And that's one of the main reasons why I'm keeping my larval. All right. Um, I hope you guys uh, find that useful. And I will talk to you on the forums.